day and you're like, what on earth is that slightly skinnier Adele doing on stage? <laughs> with things for girls like me. You know, it's like, why can't I find a guy that's like, oh, damn, I love neurotic Jewish girls with psoriasis. Mm. Mm. Sir, do you like Jewish girls with skin conditions? Well, if you're not doing anything later. my job this is the greatest job this is the problem though is that as a female comedian which you got to be a strong powerful woman to do this right give it a strong <laughs> but i gotta be around dude comics all the time and all they like to talk about is how bad they're at sex all the time they're always like oh my god i'm so bad at this i don't know what i'm doing i thought it was an elbow <laughs> But I like to think I'm pretty good at it, and for two reasons. One, I have self-esteem high enough to where I have confidence in my abilities. And two, I have self-esteem low enough where I'll do whatever you want so you won't leave me. dark there, didn't I? <laughs> Recently had to move, you guys. I moved across the country from New York to Los Angeles. And guys, I live in a pretty cool part of town, okay? I live in like the era where people jog with their dogs, which like me and my dog, we understanding we're never gonna jog together because <laughs> we have very similar body types. We're kind of short, stocky, barrel-chested, eight nipples. We're not going out together. <laughs> Neighborhoods, you can find these dudes with this very specific haircut where it's like on the side, and then it's shaved. Like to me, it looks like a Hitler youth haircut. <laughs> Which is fine, it's fine. I feel like that's the mullet of our time where it's like, party on the left, sing high, not the rest. So, 